Hey guys, Retro Stitch Gaming here, back again with the final part of our short Jurassic World Evolution series. We've built our Site B um, Safari Park. We've, it's full of carnivores, herbivores, everything. And in today's episode, we're going to finally do the tour. Really looking forward to this. I hope you guys have been too. So let's get on with it. We're going to do it in the Jeep because it just feels a little bit more... It just feels better that way, I think, than the gut gyrospheres. It just feels... I'd rather do it in the... Um, in the jeep i think it looks a lot more like a proper safari this way so out we go the gates let's have a look what we've got so i think we'll go off to the left first and explore the woodlands and see what we find there's a fight kicking off between two carnivores i won't go to that way we'll do our safari hopefully we'll get some really cool pictures on our way around see some cool stuff happening some dinosaurs interacting some fights some hunting that sort of thing so off we go let's go off into the woods can i go this way I might have gone the wrong way which is not a good start guys can i get through there might nope we're gonna have to make a turn around sorry guys bad start from the off <laughs> I hope you enjoyed the last two episodes, which were basically just setting everything up and getting it ready for this. This is the main event. So off we go. Herbivore feeder. Here we go. There's the main safari area, but we don't want to go to that area. There's a nice sauropod there. And there's the Spinosaurus. So actually, guys, we'll go, we will go over here first and let's see if this Spinosaurus is about to make a kill. Got a dead dinosaur on the floor, not sure what it is. Whoa, he does not best, please. Yeah, that is our one and only Spinosaurus in the park. I didn't want to have too many large carnivores, as everything's going to get killed. But yeah, we've got our Spinosaurus here. I wanted to really get a nice, big, open safari feel to this place. So there's hardly anything for the tourists and the guests. It's just one huge open island. Let's get a picture of this bad boy. <laughs> that is a that is a close up. He does not look best pleased. We're, yeah, let's let's move on. He he looks pretty angry. There's a Brachiosaurus over there. I absolutely love Brachiosaurus. It's one of my favourite dinosaurs. Definitely my favourite sauropod. Oh, there's a lot of dinosaurs over there actually. Let's, let's check it out. There's another dead dinosaur. Poor thing, it's a parasaur, dead in the water. Oh wicked. This could make for a good a good picture. Maybe not. But that definitely is. Look at those there. Let's try and get the water in the shot as well. Zoom in. Got a lot of dinosaurs there, including a dead one. <laughs> All those different sauropods. I think we've got a Camarasaurus there, a Brachiosaurus, a Diplodocus. Absolutely awesome. Right, let's go into the woodlands and see what we've got living in the jungles. We'll follow the uh, gyrosphere track. Strutomimus? That's probably going to get killed by that uh, small carnival there. Was it a raptor? I'm not sure what it was. I didn't... Not much going on here, actually. I thought we'd see a bit more in the jungle. Huge open jungle. Oh, open jungle land I did. Here's a nice little air uh, opening in the woodland here. What dinosaurs have we got living in here? We should be able to get in there. Why can't we get in? Won't let us in. It's quite a private area. Awesome. Can't get into the opening, so it's quite a secluded private area for those. Oh, I thought he was going to charge right into us then. Let's speed along and see what else we've got. I feel like you're actually on a proper safari here. Absolutely awesome. I'm really happy with this. Oh, we've got another dead dinosaur. Gallimimus, maybe? Got a low health dinosaur over there. Here we go, getting into what have we got here? Dinosaurus, a 
Carnosaur, what have we got over there? It's a Camerasaurus, I think. And here we've got a Carnivore, let's see what he's up to. Oh, we've been rammed into. That picture got completely ruined by the charging dinosaurs. Let's try and back up. Oh, we've got two carnivores here. Are they the same species? Yes. They, they've been released for quite a while, but they're hanging around in a little pack, which is good. It'd be good if we get to see them hunt something. That'd be really cool. It looks like we are going to get to see. We're going to try and take on this. No. There's an Edmontosaurus. I really like the Edmontosaurus. Really pretty. Love the blue head. There's quite a gathering here. Really want him to hunt and try and take something down. Doesn't look like he's going to. So hopefully we'll see. Whoa, here we go. Got a bit of a fight kicking off between these two. Make for a good picture. Two fighting dinosaurs. Let's see who's going to win this showdown. Oh, he's low on health, the carnivore is, but he's not backing down. He is not backing down. They're both low on health. And the herbivores won. Let's just heal them both up. He's gone. We've got a Stegosaurus here and an Ankylosaurus. Is it an actually? Let's take a photo of all these dinosaurs enjoying the feeder. They all look like they're really enjoying themselves there. I love the Stegosaurus with the red fins, or the spikes, whatever you want to call, to call them, the spines. Here's one of our viewing areas, a really small secluded viewing area. There's the gy gyrosphere. If we go through this woodland. Oh, we've got a few dinosaurs here. All look like they're okay. Edmontosaurus. Triceratops. And here we are in the main safari here. Let's see what we've got going on. We've not yet seen our Tyrannosaurus, so I'm interested to see where he is. We've seen our other large carnivore, the Spinosaurus. But he's been fighting again. Those those are sauropods or whatever they're uh, these guys Whoa! They they are very territorial. They keep fighting a lot. Let's just heal these guys up. Oh, they've run away. <laughs> I think we're stuck. No, we're gonna get out. Sauropelters. I think they're sauropelters, aren't they? That's what I meant. There's an Ampliosaurus. Yeah, the other sauropelter. They're very territorial. They've, they've been fighting a hell of a lot, I've noticed. Make my way around the... Uh, is that a raptor? Oh, here we go. We've got a raptor here. Is he gonna go in for a kill? Doesn't look like it. Or it, oh no, no, he, I think he is actually. Going to take him down in the way. Has he done it? Yeah, he's took down that. He's not going to eat it though. He's literally just done it for the hunt. I wonder where the rest of the raptors are because we have actually got quite a big pack of raptors living in here somewhere. So Raptorus and Ankylosaurus are having a fight somewhere. My money's on the Ankylosaurus, that huge ball on its tail. I've got like a little savanna area up here in like a little opening in the trees somewhere. So this road should lead us to it. Is that a Brachiosaurus over there? And an Ankylosaurus. Let's follow the path, try and find that other little opening that we've got. Here's our other viewing area that I've made. There's three tourist areas in this park. Aha, here it is. Are we going to be able to get through those trees? Because that is the other opening area where there's probably a lot of dinosaurs living. There's our Tyrannosaurus as well, so I do want to get through here and see what he's up to. Definitely want to see what he's been getting up to. Come for the dark pattern. It's my favourite um, skin for this for the Tyrannosaurus. I think it looks absolutely stunning. he is. Oh yes. It looks absolutely beautiful. Let's follow him around. Let's see what he's going to get up to. Doesn't look too happy. 
<laughs> He's literally just stayed in the area where we made him. He only come out over there. So this is probably his territory now and he's um, checking around the perimeter. Quite a good hunting ground here, so there's plenty fruit to eat around here. Plenty of herbivores. The swamp area is down here. I hope we can get to it. Yeah, we can just to follow the gyrosphere. Go down into a low swamp. There should be a lot of dinosaurs down here, hopefully. Really nice secluded area. Let's see what we've got. I don't think there's many carnivores that have come down here yet. We've not seen a uh, uh, what are they called? The Diffusauruses, the ones that spit the venom? We've not seen any of them yet. There's quite a large pack of them living in here somewhere. I was hoping that they'd come down into this swamp area. I was perfectly suited to them, but it doesn't look like there's any dinosaurs down in the swamps whatsoever. Which is strange because before there was tons of. Oh no, we've got, we've got a couple of dinosaurs over there. Let's go and have a look. See what we've got. Oh, we've got a sauropod, is it a patasaurus there? Very majestic, he's loving life down here. Penceratops. <laughs> sorry, sorry guy. But yeah, there's not, there's not many, oh. Yeah, so there are some dinosaurs down here, it just looks like they're hiding themselves fairly, fairly well. There's a goat, <laughs> very exciting. See if our Tyrannosaurus is still in this nice little opening that he seems to have claimed as his territory. He's not here at the moment. Where is it? He's not here at the moment. So he has moved away somewhere. We've got down to the ladder. Look, there's that triceratops. Looks like it, yeah. Go back out into the main attraction of the park. Oh, there's a Stegosaurus in our way. <laughs> Try not to crash into it. The main att main attraction of the park is the giant open plains that I've got. See if the Spinosaurus is still around. See what he's up to. So he was hanging around this watering hole before, which is where I wanted him to hang out. Oh, what have we got here? Dead dinosaur. And a Coryophosaurus there. Happy with this open safari that I've made. Where's the Spinosaurus? Because he's definitely around here, so he seems to be keeping close to this hunting ground. I suppose it is the perfect area for him to live here, but all the water which they like to be close to, as well as this huge variety of dinosaurs for him to uh, attack and eat. Got a dead dinosaur here. Was that a Dilophosaurus we finally found one? Yes we have. Where's the Spinosaurus? He was definitely around here somewhere. I wanted to see him one more time before ending the safari. I wonder where he's gone. This is literally the perfect place here. I don't think we've actually seen a Ceratosaurus even on this one. I suppose that's the thing with safaris, you don't always get to see everything. It depends on where they're hiding. Oh, we've got a fight kicking off here. That's uh, what's it between? Oh, and the raptor has won. Where's that Spinosaurus gone? Who knows? Right, we'll take the car back. I think I will do another episode actually and we'll do a safari from the air. We'll do an air tour of the park and the helicopter to see what we can see. We might be able to locate the dinosaurs that we want to see better that way. So let's take this car back. Oops, Stegosaurus in the way again. I think like to get in the way a lot. And we're back into the safe den. And 
there we go. That was my uh, tour, guys. I hope that you enjoyed it. Really, uh, a lot of fun making that. It was good to see, uh, have a tour of the park. Really hope that you enjoyed it, guys. Thank you so much for watching. Don't forget to like this video and subscribe to our channel. Really appreciate it. And so until next time, guys, see you later.